last summer, most of us missed out on the fun of going out to a ball game. But as more people get vaccinated, Governor Walls has said he hopes more people will be able to attend outdoor sporting events. And the Rochester honkers are ready with a brand new field manager on the job. Megan Zempel spoke with him this morning and joins us live with more. Jess, it's never too early to start thinking about summer, and with summer comes baseball. The sports world stood still around this time last year as the COVID-19 pandemic descended on the nation. But now, as most of us look forward to continued normalcy, the Rochester Honkers baseball team is gearing up for a new season. They are slated to play a full 72-game season, which kicks off May 31st. Last year, they were only able to play 37 games. Fans were limited to a cap of 250 and eventually were able to go to 340 with precautions in place. As far as this season is concerned, fan capacity hasn't been decided yet. They are taking a wait-and-see approach as the start of the season draws closer. New field manager Paul Wiedner says, yes, winning is important, but bringing the community better together is what matters most. I've always known that this is a very rewarding thing to do and you know, I go back to, again, the community part of it, though, because as much as I, I enjoy the, obviously, the on-field stuff and, and getting everybody bought in towards the same goal of winning games, it's not all about winning, but it's about creating an atmosphere that is all pulling in the same direction towards winning. That's fun. Wiener acknowledged that this season may also be adjusted if the pandemic causes issues, but he says the players are prepared and their morale is high and they are excited to see fans again. The Honkers' first game at home is June 1st at Mayo Field. Look for more on this at KTTC.com. Reporting live, Megan Zempel, KTTC News. It is nice to